Located in St. Mark's Square, the Campanile was built as a watchtower to sight approaching ships and protect the entry to the city. Begun in the early 10th century, it was slowly raised in height and acquired a belfry and a spire, making it one of the world's tallest buildings in the Middle Ages. The historical Campanile, visible to distant ships in the Adriatic Sea, collapsed on July 14, 1902. The reconstructed tower was inaugurated on April 25, 1912, on the occasion of St. Mark's Feast Day, exactly 1,000 years after the foundations of the original building had allegedly been laid. In 1900, the English classical scholar and poet Alfred Edward Hausmann was on holiday in Venice when he befriended a young gondolier named Andrea. Hausmann then visited regularly in the next few years. When Andrea fell ill and was unable to work, Hausmann sent him money. He recounted the Campanile's collapse in the following poem. Far known to sea and shore, four square and founded well, a thousand years it bore, and then the belfry fell. The steersman of Trieste looked where his mark should be, but empty was the west, and Venice under sea. From dusty wreck dispersed, its stature mounts amain. On surer foot than first, the belfry stands again. At the fall of the day, again its curfew tolls, and burdens far away the green and sanguine shoals. It looks to north and south, it looks to east and west. It guides to Lido mouth, the steersman of Trieste. Andrea, fare you well. Venice, farewell to thee. The tower that stood and fell is not rebuilt in me.